So you <laughs> watched Raw this week. I saw that we were both on Facebook as Raw was going on and both yeah. continually posting things. Yeah. Next time, why don't we do that uh, on, like, one instead of each posting on our own page? Let's look kind of like the Monday Night Wars <coughs> where you would flip between channels. You sure. Flip, flip between tabs. Yeah. Um. Any, anyway, of course, you know, this was a big, uh, the big, big weekend where everybody was like, oh, this is, this is going to be the weekend that changes wrestling history. Yep. Must have, which, by the way, that was my that was apparently my Mike Tyson wrestling uh, Mike Tyson as a wrestling fan impression. Oh man! Now there's an idea for a TNA correspondent. <laughs> this is going to be a weekend we'll remember forever. <laughs> this, oh yeah, this has I, this, this has <laughs> legs. Remember the, on the on the crap hole they were asking how wrestling crap radio characters are invented. <laughs> oh God! Yeah, they are, they they just happen by accident. Yeah, it's not uh, Mark, something we sit there and, and, and plot and scheme. Yeah, Mark, mark this one down, RustCrabRadio.com, the <laughs> first mention slash appearance of, of a future Mike Tyson Rust Radio. Yeah. Oh, now what? Oh, no. Uh, I almost don't even want to answer the phone. Seriously, I don't. Crap Radio. Hey, this is this is I am Mark Tyson. I, I I want to know why you guys haven't had any shows lately. I I, I really want to know. Uh, I really want to know the scoop on uh, is is Triple H uh, what he's really what his plans are for the WWE. I want you to listen real close, Iron Mark. Listen real okay. close. Okay. Well. Hung up on him. Oh boy. We better. Boy. Can't believe someone's interrupting current news. <laughs> WrestleCrap Radio. Hey, hey, this is this is I on Mark Tyson. Oh boy. Iron Iron Mark Tyson. I just I just want to know um I know I know um there's a, there's a lot of ludicrous uh, a lot of ludicrous news out here. You guys have been doing a lot of ludicrous stuff on your show, uh, but I want to I want to know. If you guys know anything about the condition of Big Show and Mark Henry, I mean, are they okay? Are they in a, in a local hospital still? Why? Why would they be in a hospital? Because they 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 got hurt in the ring. The ring collapsed on them. Oh, fucking Mark! Goodbye. <laughs> How did that guy get her phone number? <laughs> I, I, that's a good question! Oh no! I hope it's not the Muppets calling! Oh boy. <laughs> waka waka waka! WrestleCrap Radio! Hey, this is, this is, this is Mark Tyson. You guys, you guys, uh, why didn't you guys have a show last week? We were, uh, Mr. Braxton was, uh, vomiting <laughs> with rage from food poisoning. I was, uh, I was really, um, I was really, um, outlandishly depressed, and I couldn't get my news. But I gotta, I gotta ask you guys something, uh, what is the, what is the current condition on the Muppets? Waka, waka, waka! I, I, that's that that that's ludicrous. I want to know: um, Did any of the Muppets get hurt backstage? It was a lot of. It seemed like there was a lot of tension, a lot of ingregious tension. Oh, what, a, what a fucking work! Goodbye. <sighs> oh boy! Once again, how does this guy have our phone number? And two. Wait, I have a question. No. What? And two. Earlier in the show. Yes. You were talking about how China would not become a recurring character and that would never catch on. Yet <laughs> Iron Mark Tyson continues to call in. And believe it or not, he's got his fans. 
N I no, I don't believe that. Yeah. This be Jim? Maybe, maybe, maybe I, I don't know. I don't even think I want to know. Ah. Wrestle Crap Radio. This is not in my creation. You guys, are, you guys are full of it. Big Flair didn't have any money problems. He was a limousine riding, jet flying, son of a gun. Oh, what a mark. And the Christmas show just comes to an end. <laughs> a grinding halt. <laughs> Apparently, uh, Ric Flair is, in fact, having financial difficulties. <laughs> Don't believe Iron Mark Tyson. I, I, can't, I can't believe that uh, Iron Mark Tyson called in again, no. That, I hope that wasn't the Christmas miracle you were speaking of. <laughs> oh. oh, boy. Think, I, think, I, think this is BM Punk? Oh. Wrestle Crap Radio. Hey, hey, this is Iron Mark Tyson. Iron, I heard Mark uh. Tyson calling in again. You know, I, 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 I know you guys will... Well, really having a good time and be all ludicrous about uh, about Natalia Nineheart farting, but uh, you know, you guys don't know how deadly it is. If she actually if she happens to shit her pants and uh, and uh, maybe 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 set her buttocks on top of her opponent. They go get disease. Oh, what a mark! Goodbye. Why couldn't have this rang like about that's, five that's, minutes ago? Yeah, Bert. Oh, uh, Russell Crap Radio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's on. He's on. Mark Tyson. Iron Mark Tyson calling in. Yeah, yeah. You, you guys are really being ludicrous today. W why are we being ludicrous? <laughs> you're, you're, you're sitting here and you're talking about you're talking about uh, uh, Bert from Sesame Street fornicating with Miss Piggy. You don't have any idea what was going on in the world right now. I, no, I, I guess, I... No Holds Barred is being released on DVD. We were just talking about this, yes. I know this. Oh, okay, so you have a satellite, a pirate satellite feed of our show as well. Have you ever thought, thought to consider about how the danger Hulk Hogan and his family's in? What if Zeus comes looking after Hogan and tries to cripple Brooke like he, like, like he crippled Hogan's brother in the movie? Oh, Fucking Mark. Goodbye. Oh, okay, that's it. That is enough. Yep. Oh, did. oh goodness. Uh -oh. oh. Oh my goodness. Here it goes. Phone oh, ringing boy. again. Wrestle crap radio. Hey, this this is Iron Mark Tyson. Iron Mark Tyson. Well, yeah. 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 Hey. Hey, I just wanted to call in and wish you guys a happy anniversary. I'm going to guess you're going to have some memories for us. Is that right? I got a lot of memories. Uh, you got two minutes and 21 seconds worth of memories. I remember... I remember that I listened to your show trying to get the latest wrestling news. And Blade was making fun of a lot of, a lot, a lot of, the, a lot of the wrestling fans that like CM Punk. Mm-hmm. And he made a he made a voice that kind of sounded like something like mine. Right. It kind of sounded so, something like yours. It doesn't really sound like it now. Or you have like nasal congestion or something? A cold, perhaps? I got a I got a spinal problem. Oh no, that's not good. I want my, my apology. My my back is broke. Mm. But that's besides the point. Mm-hmm. Everybody enjoyed Blade's impression that kind of sounded like Mike Tyson. So they got me on because I kind of say I sound like Mike Tyson. And it's it, I want to say it's really been an dubious distinction to be a part of your guys' show. And I know that sometimes I get a little excited about uh, the wrestling news. And it's just because I'm a fan. You know, in, in sure. many ways, aren't we all a spectacular, stupendous fan of wrestling? Uh, you, you, absolutely. And boy, guys, I haven't been on your show in so long. It's just like, <laughs> I sound like my tongue's got st 
stung by a batch of bees. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah. You should. You should probably go. You should probably go see a doctor about that. It sounds very painful. Do you have? Do you have twenty seconds worth of memories left? This is my greatest memory, being here on the 11th anniversary show. Oh, that's that's delightful. <laughs> Boy, well, thanks for calling in. Make sure you go right. get your, your tongue checked out. And... Yeah. <laughs> wow. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, no. Not ex <laughs> was not expecting him to call in, I'll say that. That was another delightful uh, memory.